Ladies and gents, boys and squirrels, it's your boy, Louie Lou, with your product review. And if you didn't know, now you know. And it's your girl, Suki Sue, who has her own theme music. And before we get to the bam in the van, we're going to see if we can get Suki to do a high five. High five, Suki. Good girl. There's your treat. And bam, we're in the van. And if you guys notice, I've been limping. Yesterday, I was digging for gold, and I pulled a muscle in my leg. It was a minor injury. But a bang. All right, let's get on with this. Let's put the shades away. Let's grab the knife and uh, see what we got. Well, I got this already unboxed. This is a uh, shoulder holster. It's by Condor. Super cheap. It's only like 22, 23 bucks. <laughs> Very inexpensive. It's kind of weird. It came like, like with the gun vertically. I adjusted it so it's horizontally. Um, it's a little twisted, sister. But uh, we'll figure that out. And it has these straps to hook up with your belt loop. Uh, one I was able to take off. This one I kind of folded up, but I'll probably end up cutting it. But uh, we'll give that a try. See how that works. Ooh, shake it. See what we got in here. We got some BBs. So we got a holster. We got BBs. What could be in this box? I think you guys have a clue. I'm going to pop it open. Oh, these are from Umarex. They're the black diamond um you know what i don't think they are from umarex i think they're from hordaday or an addy Horda uh, yeah i don't know how to read but they're from them but uh, i think they're sold by umarex girl you look fine tonight you make me say sucky sucky but uh, they're saying uh i heard some chat about the copper uh, BBs not being so good for the guns. They jam them up. So we got some official ones. And let's see what we got here. Woo, chuck it. Look at that. A little BB pistole. That's it. A little closer. And uh, that is the Umarex XBG semi-automatic BB pistol that's in an adult-proof case. And uh, we'll see if we can get into this thing like a saw. Uh-oh, Suki got some BBs. You know, I should tighten this table up. And uh, let's see if we can get that out. Ah, not quite. Let's give another choppy chop. See if that helps. Woo, look at that. That's cool. They have one that looks kind of like a Glock. But for some reason, exact same price. No, it's $2 more. But exact same specs. And uh, they would not ship it, maybe because it looks too real. I don't know. But that one looks pretty sick. That's what that looks like. Pop. And, uh, yeah, it doesn't cock. I said cock. Um, and there's your safety. Ah, tight safety. There's your mag release. Metal mag. Holds 19 rounds. And uh, cool feature here. That's where you load the CO2 in the back strap. Pretty sick. And uh, you know, the greatest thing is about this, it was like 30 bucks. Check it out right there.
Amazing. Well, we'll see. If it works, it's amazing. If it doesn't work, it's worth not worth it. All right. So uh, what else we got to do? Let's see if there's anything else in here. I doubt that there is. Maybe some instructions, but I don't really know how to read. I have dyslexia. There's something written in this card. There it is. Instructions. Trash. A couple other little things. Maybe some safety, but you guys know how uh, I do with all that safety stuff. And Let's see if I can tighten this table up a little bit. Nope. Can't open. Can't make it more secure than that. So we're just going to give Sookie the treat. We're not going to make her high five. Look how gentle she is. Can you believe that? She does not bite the hand that feeds her. Those are some uh, stale beef jerkies that I gave her. Not too soft. Matter of fact, not soft at all. All right, enough jibber jabbering. Let's get out. We're going to load this up and shoot it. Pop! And bam, we're in the driveway. Almost forgot today's pair of vans. And let's see what we got here. We got the Vans National Geographics. Let's take a look at those real quick. Look at those. Look how cool those look. And, and they kind of go with the outfit, but I think these go better. But look how awesome those are. They got the protectant on the toe, the yellow heel badge, and that huge National Geographic's logo. Those are pretty cool. I like them. And uh, now I've showed them to you. And we don't chuck those. We put those down gently-ish. Okay. Now we're really going to go and test it out. Bam. We're in the driveway. So if you like to lie in the sun. And uh, let's uh, load this up. Little thing slide down. It should lock in place. There it does. Let's get these BBs. And uh, oh, unlock it. And they kind of go in at the bottom. Oh, and they just roll right out the front. That's kind of weird. Maybe that was just a uh, accidental discharge. That's 19. They go in pretty easy. Only a few of them get dropped. Like it's hard. I had to say something about them getting dropped. And uh, that last one's. All right. That's a fully loaded magazine. That's going in there. Should probably put the CO2 in first. I don't know where they go in. But uh, you know what we like to do here? We like to give a little dab, dab a do, a little jizzle on the nizzle. Just rub it in. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Put some sexy music on during that. And uh, that doesn't look like it's in place. I think it needs to drop down a little bit more. There it goes. Drop it. And uh, it's pretty cool. You don't need any tools for this one. It's got a little pop up. And uh, that's it. We're in there like swimwear. And let's try this, uh, see if it goes into this holster. Holster, harness, called oh, something. And uh, I've got a twisted system. Let's give it a little straightening out here. That looks right-ish. Give us a right-handed. And uh, 20 bucks. Huh? And uh, that snaps right in. This is probably going to be in fast forward. Because you know I like to dance to the time warp again. Ah, one snap will do. And... Uh, all right, we're ready to give it a shot. I took this one strap that's supposed to connect to your belt and went across with it, so it's a little less flopping around. But, uh, yeah, it still doesn't fit right. But uh, we're not going to be using it in the holster. We're going to be using it like this. And uh, let's see. Safety off. And... I'm not sure if it's charged or not, but we're going to give it a shot. Right there. It works.
Whew, got a sweet little group there. Awesome. And then do a, uh, get that bag out the way. Do a little rapid fire. See what kind of muzzle rise it has. And those are probably all over the place. Yeah, all over there. But all on target. This is pretty cool. Did I mention to you guys it was 30 bucks only? Fine German quality here. Let's see, what else should we shoot? I'm going to try to hit that lid. And I'm going to try to hit that barcode. Really nice. This thing's super accurate. I was surprised. And uh, let's see how quick we can get on target with it. I'm just going to shove it in there without the thing. And pretty sweet little gun here. I mean, BB launcher. And Sweet. Uh, I think I got a couple more rounds left. I'm going to try to squeeze it right into that tiny little box. Oh, I think we're out. It's nice how the thing pops out. All right, we're going to cut here, reload, and come back. I'm back from reloading. I'm going to take this thing off. It's just silly. And uh, just hold this in my hand. You know, I used to have a 9mm that shot 19 rounds, so it's called a Steyr GB, but it had a really fat handle. Um, all right, I'm going to shoot this some more. Oh, wait. Finger off the trigger when I'm not shooting. It's always good to practice those safety habits. Even though I could probably shoot myself in the foot. Ow. Felt it. Not very hard. Pretty cool, I must say. I'd like some dots on the back side. All right, I'm going to try shooting the uh, bunch of layers. It's definitely not going to stick. I'm going to shoot an angle so it doesn't ricochet back, even though it probably won't hurt. And uh, I'm just going to go ahead now and shoot out the rest of this magazine here into the box on top. That's it. Shoot an air. Maybe not. <laughs> oh, it's a BB gun. Come on. Oh, yeah, there we go. We're out now. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> All right, look at that. Safety on. Put it down. I love it. I'm not going to put it down. I'm going to show you. Um, all right, pretty cool. The Umarex, it's something like a XBG. It's got some Piccanini rail here if you want to put like a laser or something. I like that mag release, it just comes right out like butter. Metal mag, easy uh, CO2 cartridge. Oh, you know what? I still got some CO2 left. Let's shoot some more until I run out. Okay, let's shoot some more from a different POV. I'm going to take the safety off and pop. I think that might be it. No, we got a few more left. And... Let's get that little box in the corner. Uh, 
That was the last. Okay, now we're going to see what it looks like up close. I'm going to try to hit inside the D. I feel like the CO2 is running out and uh, pretty accurate. And I'll go for a quick rapid fire. Man, that's four magazines already and still got CO2. All right, here we go. Fifth magazine still going. You guys know how many? 19 times 5 is? Me neither. They told me there'd be no math. Uh, upper left-hand corner. Not bad. Let's go for a 6 mag. All right, 6 magazine. One CO2, it's got to be running low, and let's go. I'm going to shoot for that white. Yeah, it sounds like it's low, or it's not feeding. I overstuffed the uh, BBs. All right. First malfunction, and once again, human error. can shoot anymore. There's still gas. That's what she said. Uh, all right, I'm gonna load it up again and see if I can get a seventh magazine out of this. All right, seventh mag. I'm sure you guys are getting bored. I'm just gonna go. still more juice, right. believe it or not. This is mag number eight. Still going. Unbelievable. Oh, my finger's getting tired. Oh. All right, I'm done. I hope you had fun. And with that said, let's end this video. Ciao, bunga. Palm to the cam. Bam.